everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to take a look at Ashley. I have never done a review on her, so it's time. So stay tuned. Hi everyone. Welcome back to Coco's Hair Solutions. I'm Coco and today's wig is going to be Ashley from Paula Young. She is a long bob and um, she is in the VersaFiber product, in the VersaFiber line, and that means that her fibers are all heat friendly and can withstand curling. So that is a really nice feature. And uh, they come, this line comes in a lot of beautiful rooted colors. And today's color is going to be honey rooted. I've got her right here in the box. Let's take a look at all her information. There it is. So we can see that beautiful color. This is, oh, it's not in honey rooted. It's in buttered toast, which is the same color that I have on right now of this wig. This is in the same family, but this is Heidi VersaFiber and this is Ashley in VersaFiber. So let's go ahead and take a look at the cap construction. So Ashley is not a lace front like Heidi is but she is an open cap construction. So look at that, that looks very nice. We've got all those open wefts here, so she'll be nice and cool. We have a very wide, comfortable velveteen band to go across the front hairline, which is really, really nice. Makes it very comfortable. We have open ear tabs. Let's see if we can show them a little bit better. Okay, here they are. Open ear tabs, and they also have um, fibers sewn on the underside of them so that they come out at the side of your head um, from underneath the cap on both sides. They have metal stays in the ear tabs. They also have the Velcro closures here on the end and then we have an extended open nape. So that's really comfortable and it allows for comfort and also breathability because it's all open. This is gonna be a very cool wig to wear. All right, even at 4.6 ounces. And uh, Heidi was 4.8, I believe. Okay, so let me go ahead and we'll try her on. All right, here we go. Okay, well, here we go. We've got the same color wig on that I had. She's got this beautiful, cool blonde and ash brown. Um, undertones oh my gosh look at her oh my gosh she's comfortable the cap is so comfortable I, i've told you it many times these versa fiber caps are so comfortable so she's a long bob so she hits me down on my to my shoulders and one side wants to flip a little bit but we can move it to have a uh, go under or we can let it do whatever it wants, kind of like our own bio hair. Remember that when, when we had bio hair? <laughs> At least mine, it was it would go under on this side and this side would flip all the time. It didn't matter how I curled it. it didn't matter how much hairspray I put on it. I don't know why, but it just did it that way. Okay, so let me do a quick spin. This is straight out of the box with Ashley. Now you notice how she just hits my, my shoulder blades and my collarbone area. Great movement. Of course, these Versa Fiber fibers, the heat friendly fibers are so wonderful. This is a comfortable wig. I could wear this anytime, anytime. It's beautiful. Okay, let's compare to the picture in the catalog. All right, so this is the picture of the catalog and it looks like she's got a little bit more length. Does that look real close? Maybe. Uh, it looks fuller on her than it does on me, but that could be because of where it sits on my head. My anatomy might be a little bit different than her anatomy, and so the wigs are going to look a little bit different on me. So I will put my measurements down below so that you can compare your own measurements with with my measurements. I'm eight inches from here to here, so my face is longer. And that generally translates as um, having a shorter appearance 
um, the wigs will look shorter on me. And that doesn't mean that they were made shorter or, you know, there was an error in their manufacturing. It just means that on my body, on my skull, when I wear a wig that looks like this on, on these, especially with the consistent models that we have in Polly Young catalogs, we can begin to learn, okay, it hits her on the collarbone. That means it's going to hit me right above, you know, almost at the neckline. So that's a really good thing to know because that will help you when you're choosing your wigs and looking to purchase wigs. So anyway, oh my gosh, I love her just the way that she is right now. I mean, this is, I could wear this anywhere and dress it up and, and dress it down. This is always fun. Leopard. <laughs> I love leopard or animal prints. <laughs> I know it. My kids give me such a bad time because I'm I'm all about animal prints. So when I want to put this in, what I do, especially with a longer wig, I want to part it and bring up. Okay, I'm going to put it like right here. So I'm going to part it and just take a clip, let the rest hang down, let that hang down and then bring this up and just clip it temporarily. You know, just put it up there. Okay, so then I take my headband and I decide, okay, I'm gonna put it underneath that, that little piece. So I put it underneath the hair that way and then I bring it back to where I part it, parted it and take it underneath and just twist it once so that it can stay connected and then take my clip out make sure it's laying flat or maybe I need to widen how it's laying and then that's good I can leave it like that. I can wear it, you know, there, there's lots of different colors and I can use a, a what, wire headband. Um, you know, these bangs are kind of okay. They're laying a little flat for me. So let me show you how I get lift those off of my forehead so that they don't absorb a lot of the makeup that I have on my forehead area. So I'm going to lean forward so that the the hair fibers, I can get under the hair fibers. And so what I'm doing is I'm pressing against, pull the hair fibers back and press against it that way. So with the heat of your hand, you're gonna be able to create a crease that takes the hair fibers, instead of laying down straight like this, they're kind of lifted up like this and then they arch a little bit so that they stay off of your forehead. So you see what happened? They, that process also shortens the, the hair fibers. So you would want to do that before you do any trimming on your bangs. Um, that way you don't have to trim your bangs. All you have to do is maybe press your bangs up a little bit and it gives you that extra length that uh, kind of looks soft around your face. So okay, so these this kind of hairstyle we can take these sides up. We can add a little clip over here, you know, just to keep it out of our face. I think we, we might have a little bit of an issue with this coming into our facial area. So if you're going to be needing to do a lot of work with your leaning forward, I would probably recommend doing something like this, taking, taking a clip of some sort. And there's no harm. I mean, if you're going to use a clip, you might as well use a pretty one, right? <laughs> I would <laughs> and then of course try to make them even on both sides and you know that's a real simple easy easy look it's very youthful it's it's it can look I mean, look at that rooting isn't that gorgeous this is just a beautiful beautifully done I just love the VersaFiber colors especially the buttered toast and honey rooted they're really really pretty so this is a real easy way to take care of a simple simple bob i mean it's a lob and that's a long bob and here is another way to wear it that looks very wedding like 
I'm thinking. It shows off all the beautiful highlights, allows for some sheer curtains. Oh, it just looks so natural, doesn't it? Very pretty with a little bit of height up here too. Definitely a contender for my wedding. So this is Ashley. Very, very nice. I wouldn't have known that she looked like that um, in the picture because it looked a lot longer and tapered. It looked like the haircut was tapered. So anyway, there you go. Now you're in the know and I am too. So, well, thank you so much for joining me today again. It's been a pleasure and I enjoy doing these videos for you. Thank you so much for your wonderful comments down below. Best wishes to you. Have a great week and we will see you next time on Coco's Hair Solutions. Bye-bye.